so we continue for part four we have to listen to to this exposition from simon ekman welcome to crew talk margaret tv if today is the first time coming across this youtube channel please don't forget to like share and subscribe good morning good afternoon good evening i greet you according to your time so let's listen it's good to know history so if you think that you know what we are doing is saving biafra no if you are, as we are fighting to save biafra people you we are saving you we are saving your ass in america we are saving your ass in europe when this man called abdul mutala who is now in america in america prison he he wanted to bomb america is he is he a biafra no he's from northern nigeria his father is a rich nomadic fulani he's a terrorist that is the kind of people you are going to be seeing after 20 years if Nigeria did not disintegrate. You are going to see many of them coming to America to bomb your aeroplane. Because the idea is to take over the world. So send this video to Anthony Blinken. Tell Anthony Blinken we are not scared of him. Let him come. I told you don't do like me. Don't do like me. Because if you do like me, you will get injury. <laughs> we are not looking at anybody's face. When we talk about freedom, it is not just about war. I want you people to listen to this video. Emmanuel Macron. Emmanuel Macron, tu as défini qui vomitait vos lits. Emmanuel Macron. Emmanuel Macron, tu as défini qui vomitait vos lits. This Italian woman said that Emmanuel Macron, Emmanuel Macron, described them as disgusting, cynics, and irresponsible. Emmanuel Macron is calling Amer uh, uh, Italian people disgusting, cynic, and irresponsible. Now listen to this woman, how he responded to, to him. Siamo irresponsabili. Vergogna. Irresponsabile Emmanuel Macron sono quelli che hanno. She told him, she told him the irresponsible Emmanuel Macron are those who bombed Libya because they were concerned that Italy would obtain important energy concession with Gaddafi. Do you see the truth? How these people are fighting those who would do something positive? Are you listening? Ha bombardato la Libia perché gli dava fastidio che l'Italia avesse un rapporto privilegiato in campo energetico con Gheddafi, esponendoci al caos, migrazione nel. And left us facing the chaos of illegal immigrant we are facing now. That is a fact. Quale ci troviamo? Cinici Emmanuel Macron sono i francesi che mandano la gendarmerie a rispedire indietro qualunque immigrato tenti di passare il confine a Ventimiglia. Ma soprattutto perché le cose vanno raccontate come si deve. Vomitevole e chi buono, che lo vuoi di tu?
situation in Nigeria is because they are exporting us. Mm-hmm. Otherwise, why would you be taking our oil? We have a lot of things to offer. You can't even give visa free to. You, you see, that the least anybody can do is for a country to negotiate the good of the citizens. Yeah. <laughs> so let us say people. visa free. Black people don't look for Your yourself. oil is being pumped everywhere. Mm-hmm. And in those countries that are benefiting from your oil, there is no benefit. There is no single benefit that has been negotiated for the citizen of the world. We know that, you know, as you know, it, or it is late, of course, but if it is like Nigeria is still going to stay like four years, the next four years, you will see them negotiating what I'm saying now. Mm-hmm. Every natural resources is good. Yeah. But not you. Not you as a, citizen. As a black man. Every natural resources citizen. is good. Mm-hmm. But not you mm. as a citizen. Mm. Now, watch. That our year is good, but not to us as a citizen. Africa, stampando moneta per 14 nazioni africane sulle quali applica il signoraggio, facendo lavorare bambini nelle miniere. She said, you are exploiting Africa and buy children labor in mines and by extracting raw materials as happening in Niger. In Niger. Do you see they know the impunity that these people are doing in our land? Mm-hmm. That is why Anthony mm-hmm. Blake we have the court to talk about Nigeria credible election. Mm-hmm. In Nigeria that doesn't they have any credible children. system. Hard work. Children they will go work. Yeah they will go school and job. Right on, my sister and my man, please explain because I'm reading it because I cannot read it for the people. Yes. Stop to betray each other. She also speak about immigrants they send back to Africa. Mm-hmm. The see here, here in Germany they send Africa people back back but the 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 the, 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 the other ones with with, with uh, 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 white skin color no the way they treat Africa in Europe. Oh my God.
is benefiting a lot from Nigeria. There is nothing in return. The citizens of Nigeria are not benefiting anything from the British government. The only thing you benefit is humiliation like this. Mm -hmm. Oh. I can show it. Only humiliation. <laughs> humiliation. This right, black man will cry. It's a big man, cry. Like a <laughs> cry. Big man cry. See the way they are deporting them. No respect. I'm not being you know, a that is normal. Let's say that Nigeria is a normal country now. The first, the first thing the politicians will do is to negotiate the good of the, the citizens, citizens of their country. Mm -hmm. What can we, how can we negotiate with the countries that are benefiting from our oil, mm -hmm. uh, what, what our citizens going to benefit? You go into diplomatic agreement with different countries. How can we, but of course before you do that, you must not be a terrorist country because the reason why you can never ever benefit anything from anybody, from any country in the world, is that Nigeria is a terrorist country. And the terrorism is not coming from you. Mm -hmm. Terrorism is coming from Fulani, you know, northern Nigeria. It's not coming from you, but you are paying the price of being a terrorist. Or coming from a country that has been ranked number three in the world from the terrorism index. But it is not you. It is coming from the north. And when you go to the north, it is not even coming from the Nigeria indigenous people in the north. It is coming from all over Africa. They invited the, the, 
terrorists to, to your land and you Hello my people, I have to stop here. Yeah, what do you think about the exposition that Mazi Sanu Ekman is exposing concerning the America and the British? Guys, if you like this video, do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. Follow Mazi Simon Ekman from Enter Biafra. Follow him and support the movement of Faith Biafra. Thank you for watching. See you on my next video. Bye. Bye bye, guys.